solar power is now being touted as a quick solution for farmers seeking to pump water for farm production. The National Agriculture Advisory Services now says these solutions could be expanded to supplement the dairy sector too. Because we've also had a complaint from farmers who have come to us, the dairy farmers, they would like to be supported with the milk cooling equipment, but unfortunately they do not have access to power. And of course most of them have ended up making losses. When the milk gets spoiled, they throw it away. So I think it is something that we can look into that in addition to the milk coolers that we give to our farmers, we can also add some solar power systems, just like we do for the irrigation systems. Similar. It is something that we can look at, yes. This is evidenced by some farmers producing milk in hundreds of liters, especially during the rainy season, despite low prices are the challenges inclusive. Okay, you see the, the the generators, the, the, the coolers, sometimes they use generators. And the generators sometimes it, it gets slow, it gets what? Break down. All those process, they don't pay that what? That milk you have already supplied them. And it's a loss. Not, not, not even here at the farm, all of the farmers, they get lost. Some small enterprises have now heeded to the government's new policy measures for development, such as the parish development model to scale up innovations in this area. We are calling the government to come and we collaborate. Perhaps uh, we pilot a renewable energy parish model where we have like uh, one square mile of land with the bulking center of like 50,000, with the renewable energy, uh, solar, uh, biogas, water pumping from this energy, yeah? So that we, we really pilot something substantial. And then we can use this model, the parish model, whereby everything is running on solar for the farmers to learn. So innovations in this area gaining momentum owing to the huge potential in the country's dairy sector and demand for its products in regional markets. Our sectors or departments like NADS, were a creation so that we could do, try together to subsidize the cost of acquiring a, a solar system, also to procure uh, energy efficient solar milk coolers. Available figures show the country produced 2.5 billion liters of milk in the financial year 2018-2019 compared to 2.7 billion liters in 2019-2020.